peace, how to find it, and how to keep it in troubling times. These are all Bible verses that speak of peace. And some of these verses show that in order to have peace, we are required to do our part. We need to be mindful of our own hearts as God's blessings always flow when we walk in obedience. Living in peace is often an active choice of our will rather than a passive waiting for peace to fall in our circumstances. Psalm 29, 11. The Lord blesses his people with peace. Psalm 34, 14. Turn from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. Psalm 32, 17. The fruit of righteousness will be peace. The effect of righteousness will be quietness and confidence forever. Psalm 37 verse 37. Consider the blameless, observe the upright. There is a future for the man of peace. Psalm 85 verse 8. I will listen to what God the Lord will say. He promises peace to his people, his saints, but let them not return to folly. Psalm 119, verse 165. Great peace have they who love your law, and nothing can make them stumble. Isaiah 9, verse 6. For unto us a child is born, a son is given, and the government will be on his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Isaiah 26, verse 3. You will keep in perfect peace him whose mind is steadfast because he trusts in you. Isaiah 26, verse 12. Lord, you establish peace for us. All that we have accomplished, you have done for us. Isaiah 54, verse 10. Though the mountains be shaken and the hills be removed, yet my unfailing love for you will not be shaken, nor my covenant of peace be removed, says the Lord, who has compassion on you. Isaiah 55, verse 12. You will go out in joy and be led forth in peace. The mountains and hills will burst into song before you, and all the trees of the field will clap their hands. Isaiah 57, verse 19. Peace, peace to those far and near, says the Lord, and I will heal them. Matthew eleven twenty eight to 30 Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. John 14, verse 27. Peace I leave with you. My peace I give you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your heart be troubled and do not be afraid. John 16, verse 33. I have told you this thing so that in me you may have peace. Luke 7.15 Jesus said, Your faith has saved you. Go in peace. Romans 5 verse 1 Therefore, since we have been justified through faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. 
Romans 14, 17 to 19. For the kingdom of God is not a matter of eating and drinking, but of righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Spirit. Because anyone who serves Christ in this way is pleasing to God and approved by men. Let us therefore make every effort to do what leads to peace and to mutual edification. 2 Corinthians 13, 11. Be of one mind, live in peace, and the God of love and peace will be with you. 1 Corinthians 14, 33. For God is not a God of disorder, but of peace. 2 Thessalonians 3.16 Now may the Lord of peace himself give you peace at all times and in every way. The Lord be with all of you. Colossians 3.15 Let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts since as members of one body you were called to peace and be thankful. Final thought. Don't allow fear to sit on the throne of your heart. Make a conscious choice today to place the Prince of Peace on that throne. This has been brought to you by EncouragingBibleQuotes.com, a ministry of Catherine Walden.